one of those really simple projects you can make out of a single 2x4. First thing I did was cut two 20 inch sections on the miter saw. Then I took all my pieces to the table saw and ripped off one side of the rounded corners, just an eighth of an inch off. This gives me a nice square edge that I can use up against the fence to start ripping off my half inch stock. All the pieces for this bench are going to be inch and a half wide by half inch thick and of course various lengths. Well I can confirm that this project will be a less than 2x4 project. This is all my materials laid out ready to be assembled and I've still got two of these long strips of my half inch stock plus some small scraps down there so uh, quite a bit less than a full 2x4 to make this. After letting the glue dry overnight, uh, this is all all glue joints only, and you know it's it's pretty strong. So no mechanical fasteners. I'm gonna glue the bottom panel in real quick, and then I can cut out the holes for the condiments. I'm not gonna put a hole in here for the napkins. Uh, I've decided against that because I went to find some more napkins, and I was uh, left with a bunch of different sizes. So no sense in cutting up specific size for napkins when that may change. There's no problem with just sitting them on here like so. Uh, I've also glued in back this piece right here to accept the plates, to hold the plates, and also a little shelf down here to stop them from falling. And uh, I've already tested it out, it works good, but I'll show you here in just a little bit. Right, I've got a little piece of quarter inch plywood cut with some glue on the bottom. And I'm just going to slide this underneath the seat slats. And then use some of these scrap pieces of 2 by material and gravity to clamp it in place. Now that can sit for about 15 or 20 minutes. Working on the back, and as you can see, the plates they fit in there rather well. Uh, I've cut a little bit of, or a couple of these little dividers, and I'm just going to set them in place that way the silverware doesn't want to wander around too much. Alright. There we go. That's the back. To support the condiments from below, I made this little 
made this little tray out of some scraps. And I'll just flip this over and glue it in place. Alright, so here it is all done. Um, you know, a neat little fun project. It's less than a 2x4 and there's a piece of quarter inch plywood scrap on the bottom. So, you know, even if you didn't drill the holes out for the condiments, you still have a little mini bench for less than a 2x4. Uh, like I said, I didn't do a container for the napkins because there's all different kinds of sizes of napkins and, uh, you know, no big deal to set them up there. But, you know, it turned out pretty good. Uh, the back turned out a lot better than I thought it would, and uh, it does a good job, so there you go. It's another project in the books. Uh, if you like what you see, like and subscribe, and you guys have a great day.